What if you could power your phone for 50 years without recharging? Sounds like a dream, right? Imagine a world where you never have to worry about your phone dying in the middle of a conversation, where you can go on long trips without packing a charger, where power outages are not a threat to your digital connectivity. This could be our future, thanks to an exciting development in the realm of nuclear technology. A Chinese company has recently announced plans to mass-produce nuclear batteries. Yes, you heard it right, nuclear batteries. This revolutionary technology could potentially keep your gadgets powered for up to 50 years. Now that's a lot of screen time. This isn't the first attempt at bringing nuclear batteries to the market. British and American companies have been trying to do so for several years. However, it seems the Chinese might just take the lead in this high-stakes race. The implications of this technology are mind-boggling. Think about it. A world where all our devices from phones to laptops are powered by nuclear energy. A world where charging cables become relics of the past, where power sockets are only needed for heavy-duty appliances. This could change not only how we use our devices, but also how we design our homes, our offices, and our public spaces. But before you start dreaming of a life free from the tyranny of charging cables, it's important to remember that this technology is still in its infancy. There are still many challenges to be overcome, many questions to be answered. For instance, how safe are these batteries? How will we dispose of them once they've outlived their usefulness? And most importantly, how do they actually work? So, how does this nuclear battery work? To understand that, we need to delve into some science. Nuclear batteries, also known as atomic batteries, generate electricity from the atomic energy stored within radioactive isotopes. So what exactly does that mean? Let's break it down. In the heart of a nuclear battery, there's a small amount of radioactive material. This material contains what we call radioactive isotopes. These isotopes are unstable and because of this, they naturally decay over time. As these isotopes decay, they emit what we call ionizing radiation. This isn't the kind of radiation you'd find in your microwave or coming from your Wi-Fi router. Ionizing radiation is high-energy stuff capable of knocking electrons loose from atoms. Now, here's where the magic happens. When this radiation strikes a special surrounding material, it knocks electrons loose. These free electrons can then be captured and directed to flow as an electric current. This is the same kind of electric current that powers your phone, your laptop, or even your electric car. The beauty of this process is its longevity. Radioactive decay is a process that happens incredibly slowly. Some isotopes can take thousands, even millions of years to fully decay. This means a nuclear battery can, in theory, provide a small but steady stream of electric power for an incredibly long time, up to 50 years in some cases. So, in a nutshell, a nuclear battery is a tiny power plant that harnesses the natural decay of radioactive isotopes to generate electricity. It's like having a miniature sun, right in the palm of your hand. There's no chemical reactions involved, no combustion, no moving parts. Just the steady, relentless march of atomic decay, transformed into usable power. Now that we have a basic understanding of how nuclear batteries work, let's explore the potential benefits and drawbacks of this technology. Like every technological innovation, nuclear batteries come with their own set of advantages and disadvantages. Let's start with the positive aspects. The most significant advantage of nuclear batteries is their incredibly long lifespan. Traditional batteries need to be recharged or replaced regularly, but nuclear batteries can last for decades, even up to half a century. This longevity makes them perfect for applications where battery replacement is difficult or impossible, such as space travel or deep sea exploration. Another major advantage is their consistent power output. Unlike solar or wind power, which are subject to fluctuations in weather conditions, nuclear batteries provide a steady stream of energy. This makes them a reliable power source for critical systems that can't afford to lose power, such as medical devices or military equipment. Now let's consider the potential drawbacks. The primary concern with nuclear batteries is, unsurprisingly, the risk of radiation exposure. While the level of radiation emitted by these batteries is generally low, it's still a significant concern, especially in the event of a battery failure or mishandling. The second major concern is waste disposal. Nuclear batteries use radioactive materials which produce radioactive waste as they decay. This waste needs to be handled and disposed of properly to prevent environmental contamination. And as we've seen with nuclear power plants, this is easier said than done. Lastly, there's the issue of public perception. The term nuclear tends to evoke fear and uncertainty in many people, thanks to incidents like Chernobyl and Fukushima. This could make it difficult for nuclear batteries to gain widespread acceptance, despite their many benefits. 
With these factors in mind, let's look at the current state of nuclear battery technology and what the future might hold. Despite the challenges, several companies have been trying to bring nuclear batteries to the market for years. On the forefront of this endeavor are British and American firms, each with their unique strategies and scientific approaches, all aimed at harnessing the immense power of nuclear energy in a portable form. Yet, despite their best efforts, mass production of these batteries has remained elusive. Enter the Chinese. A bold announcement from a Chinese company has shifted the landscape. They're planning to mass-produce nuclear batteries, tiny powerhouses that can last up to 50 years. This is a game-changer, a seismic shift in the world of portable power that could potentially outpace their Western counterparts. Imagine for a moment a world where your phone, your laptop, your car, all run on nuclear batteries. A world where charging isn't a daily routine but a once-in-a-decade event. That's the promise of nuclear batteries, the potential that has tech enthusiasts and environmentalists alike buzzing with excitement. But the future of nuclear batteries isn't just about convenience, it's about sustainability, about moving away from fossil fuels, and towards cleaner, more efficient energy sources. As the world grapples with climate change and the urgent need to reduce carbon emissions, nuclear batteries could play a pivotal role in the energy revolution. However, it's important to remember that this technology is still in its infancy. There are hurdles to overcome from the safe handling of nuclear materials to the public's perception of nuclear power. The road to the widespread adoption of nuclear batteries is likely to be long and fraught with challenges, yet the potential rewards are immense. The advent of nuclear batteries could transform our energy landscape, revolutionizing everything from consumer electronics to electric vehicles. The Chinese company's announcement is a promising step forward, but it's just the beginning of a much larger journey. Whether we'll all be charging our phones with nuclear power in the future remains to be seen. But one thing is clear, the age of nuclear batteries is upon us. So, what have we learned today? We've taken a deep dive into the world of nuclear batteries, a technology that could potentially revolutionize the way we power our devices. We've explored the basic science behind these energy powerhouses, understanding how they harness the energy released by radioactive decay to generate electricity. This process is not only efficient, but also incredibly long-lasting, with some nuclear batteries having the potential to last up to 50 years. We've also weighed the pros and cons of this exciting technology. On the plus side, nuclear batteries offer unparalleled longevity, high energy density, and the ability to operate in extreme conditions. They could drastically reduce our reliance on traditional power sources and potentially transform industries from telecommunications to space exploration. However, we've also acknowledged the challenges. There are legitimate concerns about the disposal and handling of radioactive waste, the potential for misuse, and the technological hurdles that need to be overcome to make these batteries safe and cost-effective. We've also examined the current state of nuclear battery technology and looked ahead to the future. A Chinese company has announced plans to mass-produce tiny nuclear batteries, a step that could potentially outpace British and American companies who have been working on this technology for years. If successful, this could herald a new era of energy use where we power everything from our smartphones to our cars with nuclear batteries. But as with any scientific advancement, it's important to approach with both optimism and caution. The potential benefits of nuclear batteries are enormous, but so are the challenges. As we move forward, it's crucial to continue the conversation about safety, ethics, and sustainability. As we stand on the brink of a potential energy revolution, it's exciting to think about the possibilities that nuclear batteries could bring. Stay tuned to our channel for more updates on this fascinating topic. Thanks for watching.